Hello, Billy Williams, MedicarePapa.com. In this video, we're going to talk about Medicare Supplement Plan G and a little bit about how much that's going to cost. So when we are working with people that are turning 65 and going to start Medicare soon, or someone who may have continued to work at age 65 and now are coming off of their group policy, or maybe a person who has been on Medicare for a while and might have an older plan, say like a plan F, and they are wanting to change to a plan G, then people want to know how much is this going to cost. In this situation, I'm going to focus on my home state of Texas for a person who is entering the market at age 65. The first thing to understand is you will need Part A and Part B of Medicare. Part A of Medicare for most people will not cost you anything because you have worked over the years to pay into the system. So Part A is basically zero cost to you moving forward. You will have to pay for Part B. Most individuals in the year 2023, the monthly premium for a enrollment in Part B of Medicare is going to be $164.90. Then it's very important to have some secondary coverage. So a very popular Medicare supplement plan is a plan G. And for an individual at age 65, it's going to cost somewhere in the neighborhood between $110 to $120 a month. This will vary depending on where you live, on your gender, and if there is a household discount. But if you have Medicare Part A and Part B is your main coverage, and you have a Medicare Supplement Plan G as your secondary, then all of your doctor hospital bills will be covered except for your annual Part B deductible with um, Medicare this year, 2023, that is $200 and $26. So that gives you some idea. If you would like specific numbers for you, uh, you can give us a call. Uh, our services are always free and we do offer free, no, obliga no obligation rate quotes. Thanks.